Okay, if you're just tuning in for the fix, let's just go through the fix really quick and then I'll talk about how we got there in a second. Uh, so right here in the ready function, I'm setting the authority. And like I showed in the last video, there was an exception being thrown with the authority being set here. I thought maybe it was just a bug in the Godot system. However, if we want to fix that, let's go ahead and just do function enter tree. And what we can do is just drag this up there, put this in the enter tree function. And if we hit play right now, it should kind of fix it. So I'm going to host a game here. So this is one client. And again, it looked like it was on the third. The, once I get the third client, you would see that exception. And right now you can see I don't have any right here. Also note that the camera is not correct yet either. Uh, we'll come back to that in a second. And if I hit join as player three, uh, you can actually see him jumping around correctly there. So the synchronization is working perfectly. We didn't get any errors. So we just need to clean up a camera issue. And I think this is where my pitfall was. So what we want to do is in the ready function right here, this check is not going to be valid right now. And I think, and I'll touch on that more in a second. So what we want to do is just grab this right here. And instead of player ID, let's use and leverage the name, which we know we have access to at, at the beginning of all peers coming into the scene. So let's just try that again. Uh, host game and as you can see the camera has been fixed because now it's correctly identified to the peer and if i run over here you can see that it's correctly synchronized between all three clients and all three clients are working correctly as expected here you can see the animations and everything as i move around look perfect and we do not have any errors down here just some uh simple warnings which is fine uh but yeah so we no longer have that error and so I, I just wanted to touch on that and and give you guys that real quick update to this the last video. So go ahead and do the last video if you if you stumble here first to get everything set up and then just make these quick two changes right here. Just add the authority set in the enter tree and then also make sure you're using the name to set up anything in like your ready function where you may have to check with the multiplayer peers uh, unique ID to make sure that we give the camera to the local player or whatever else you want to set up here respectively. So I just wanted to touch on really quick what happened with this authority issue. Well, I found an issue that I highlighted in the last video where some people were having problems using enter tree for setting the authority. It just wasn't working for them. And there's a lot of comments in here about different strategies and approaches that they use to try to get the authority set correctly. Well, most of these seem to work for me in a simple uh, just input authority setup. But once I move to this client authority full client authority approach it didn't work for me anymore and i thought that's where it broke down and i had this enter tree functionality at one point and then i abandoned it but i probably just had something else causing other issues or maybe this player id being set here was the root cause i i don't exactly remember what had happened but thankfully under my video yesterday where i talked about how to actually set up the player client multiplayer authority somebody had left a comment tldm bruno Thank you very much by the way they had said that the enter tree strategy actually worked for them and when i reread that it kind of made a little bit more sense because they were talking about that the authority gets set per peer like on the individual clients when they are spawned so you have to reset it in that enter tree function this actually resonated with me a little bit so i decided to give it another try with some fresh eyes and thankfully i did because now we know that this works correctly so i just want to give a big shout out to tldm bruno thank you very much for responding to me under the video and helping out the community with this solution because this was definitely bothering me having that exception there and i wasn't sure if it was a you know ghost and godot system or not but thankfully it is just a bug in my setup and we do have a solution here so if you are actually interested in setting up player client multiplayer authority and not just on the inputs and just give the entire player object authority go ahead and watch this video first and then head over to this one really quick but before we go i always like to do a test in the cloud just to show you guys that it's actually working in the cloud so let me go ahead and set the dns over in the multiplayer manager so i have the server running in an aws ec2 instance up here and you can see it's just sitting there waiting for some responses or connections from the player clients so let me go ahead and run a couple clients all right if i hit join as player you can see he drops in and a player has joined and let's go ahead and join in both other players and as you can see there, there are all three in there and we're not getting any exceptions in our client side. So I think this has been resolved. I think this is fixed. I just want to do one final check over here on the, the slime and make sure that the slime is correctly synchronized. I think you should be if I drag this guy right over there. Yeah, it looks like he's synchronized. And then we can also just double check over here with the first client. 
and we'll just drag them over there. Yeah, it looks like it's perfectly synchronized. Great. So we know this is fixed. I've tested it locally. I've tested it in the cloud. So I think we can call this one fixed. So appreciate the help from the community. Thanks again. And if you enjoyed this video, if this helps you fix any problems you're having with this, please like it. Please subscribe. Stay connected. Thanks for watching.